Hello, everybody. My name is Dinebot. Welcome to the Indie Show. Today, we are taking a look at Hero Generations. Now, full disclosure, uh, this game comes from a Kickstarter uh, by Scott Birdie, and I am a backer of this game, as well as having had Scott on the Indie Game Show on Sanitarium.fm. So, this is not a completely unbiased first look. I am excited about this game. It's a really cool concept, so... Uh, Let's just kind of jump in and take a look. Uh, now, this is a beta, so settings are coming soon. Uh, I've played an alpha of this, and Scott's added a lot of art, and the game is really, really looking a lot better. Uh, so let's jump in and see what we got. Yeah, I do want to overwrite my current save game. I was just messing around to make sure it all worked right. So uh, here we are in Hero Generations. Now, you'll see that I have a quest up here. I'll explain that in a minute. Continue. Build a monument. All right, now the path we choose is up to us. So let's turn off the quest menu. Uh, and this is uh, our character right here. Now you see that it says our age. Now right here we have 69 years left. Every time you move in Hero Generations, you lose a year. So bam, down to 68. So let's go fight this guy. You, know, you just fight by clicking attack and the game will roll and he wins so I lose uh, five years off my life and some gold which is unfortunate however we can go oh, what, is, what is that I can't go straight up uh, I don't want to fight him again well, in the forest we can find things a wooden hammer Yeah, they refuse to pay me tribute. I want to find out what that is. I have a baby. Find a way to raise it as your own. That looks awful. Yay, money. Nope, inventory full. I don't want to drop the baby. That would be horrible. Uh, we're still going to die. So we're steady losing years off our life. The object here is to gain fame and find a wife or a mate and uh, save the world five produces five strength heroes for every ten years adjacent four to add one strength all right so that gave us a little bit of power uh, we don't want to get a weapon shop there is a border let's go ahead and migrate so every so often your hero will reach milestones and grow. I am now an adult, and I can flip a card for a extra three strength. Sometimes it'll be money, sometimes it'll be years in your life. World three, volcano. You gain a thousand fame for that, so that's nice. Now we have a new quest. Now the quests give you fame. I really should have done some more in the other world, but... Uh, we can't unlock that chest. We can't move there. Attack! So we have defeated this guy. Earned 50 fame. We are now a squire. Enter! And she wants a hero with at least 2700 fame, which means that I cannot have kids with her. Him. It. Ooh, this thing's gonna kick my ass. This is a boss, isn't it? Yeah. I need to find a mate and uh, have a kid quickly. Enter general shop. Automatically digs on broken ground locations visited. Yes. We'll take. Um, damn. Let's get rid of that hammer. No, I, I want to get rid of the hammer. Buy hammer. Now we get back in here. Enter the general shop. I want that pick. And reduces the requirements of mates and towns by 10%. That would be a good one to have. And the milestone. We are in midlife. Plus 10. Uh, there's a lot of uh, balancing act here and oh, more strength. Uh, trying to Oh, full. Son of a biatch. 
trying to uh, get as much fame as you can, but also find a mate in time, and we are going to die. So it's going to be interesting to find out what happens when you lose all your life. Um, Scott, you probably are going to hate watching this. I do apologize for my derpiness. Attack. Did we actually? We actually won. Awesome. And we have one year left to live. The building has withered away. World Zero Forest. We are so toast. Oh, alright, let's let's do a new game. <laughs> Here we go. Zero fame, we are a peon. Turn off the quest menu. Now that's a slum now. We can repair the town eventually. We can also go into the forests and find chests. And we get some life. And some gold. And some fame. So this is all going rather well so far. Can we open this chest? Nope. Well, we'll fight this guy and probably lose. So, we lose five years off our life. But... We can... Please, please go away. You're like blocking the only town I can get to, you jerk. Yes! We are now an adult. Plus 10 to our strength. We got 2100 gold. Let's flip a card. And plus 1. So let's enter the town. Five loves you. We'll click him. So, that hero had a final score of 200 fame. Now, let's name this one Dime. We now get to flip cards to decide traits for our new child. And this is why it's called Hero Generations. You are embarking on a multi-generational quest. Ooh, plus seven. Nice. There are three rare cards, it looks like, in each set. So, new trait acquired. And those are permanent. They last through all the generations. So <clears throat> now 16 years will pass, and we are all grown up. And different buildings will be invented. And these will change the gameplay. So we want to try to kill a boss or build a monument. So let's move out. Now we have a new lifespan. And that quest item will give us 500 fame if we take it there. So. Town offers a new tribute. Return there to claim it. Tributes are offered every 10 years. Cool. Uh, we don't want to go there yet. Okay, that's the boss. Yeah, he's going to wreck us. So killing bosses is not a trivial task by any means in this game. So we have reached adulthood. We get plus 10. Um, always nice. You need to keep an eye on the milestones, obviously. Plus one life expectancy. <laughs> yeah, wrecked that guy. So as you gain strength and as you age, it does become a little easier to kill the enemies you find. A little gold. What do you do with the baby? Alright, so the random roll, we did win again. Didn't quite kill him, though. Can we enter the town and... Hmm... Not quite yet. Um, I don't want to demolish the building. We'll attack this guy. So there's a lot of exploring in this game. Kind of wandering around the map, seeing what there is that you can actually work on to help yourself improve your fame. Uh, 
Let's potentially get a better mate. I think we'll go over here to the weapon shop. We can get a shield, a wooden sword, or a grenade. We'll go with the sword. Can't afford the shield. You have a combat item. Give you extra defense, attack, or life damage points. So we'll attack. We've got the two rolls, so way more than enough to take that guy down. There's the boss. Clear all force. Two of eight. That seems like a worthy, worthy task. I wonder if we can do that before we uh, run out of lifespan. Nice. That guy would have taken eight years off our lifespan. That would have been just awful. <laughs> it looks so derpy with a baby in my hand. I've got to find out what you can do with the baby. Um, Scott, let me know what I can do with the baby. Midlife. So we're now at 35. We might be able to take on that boss sometime soon. Um, he's pretty damn strong now. So, every move is one year. So that is... How many forests? Six of eight. Where are the other two? There's one there. Now, I don't have too long to find the other one. It's probably down here somewhere. Uh, attack this guy. It's got a paintball mask. That sword. Glad I bought that weapon. Um, I don't want to try and fight that guy with that little lifespan left. What I need to do is go get another mate. I really wish that I could clear this uh, this forest quest, but I, I just don't see the last one. It's probably right over here in the clouds somewhere, but I don't think we have enough time to make it. What we're going to do is grab this gold, and then we're age 74, so we're going to go in here. You now lose strength at milestones. Ooh. I do like the aging on the characters, so that's really neat. So let's enter the town. Uh, we'll go with that. So, Final Fame Squire. Um, we'll name this one after Nico Kitwolf. We'll just do Nico because Kitwolf won't fit. She has a long name. Ooh, not as many cards that time. Oh, both my parents are dead. Temple building produces two lifespan for heroes every 15 years. Right. Uh, new quests. Kill the boss. Clear all lairs. We don't really have enough life to be doing that right now. <laughs> There's a tribute in that town, and one there. I like tributes. And we're an adult now. Tributes are good. I like tributes. Plus one life expectancy. Life expectancies seem to be fairly common. That gave us some more fame. That's complete. Clear layers. Build a monument or kill. Yeah. Can we actually... I, I don't like that he's following me. I don't want to upgrade that. Can I take you down? Barely. Aw, 
awesome. We're climbing in fame. Still a peon now. So yeah, I'm I'm really enjoying this game. It's got some surprisingly deep mechanics to it. Uh, that you really wouldn't think were there just from looking at the art style and the overhead map. But there's a lot going on in here at Generations, even at this early stage in beta. So uh, definitely think that it's one to keep an eye on. Oh, draw. That's new. You're a jerk. Yeah, get killed. Awesome. All right, so I am going to continue wandering about and becoming an awesome hero, guys. If you want to see more of this game, uh, feel free to like and subscribe to the video coming up. If you have any questions about it, let me know. And follow me on Facebook and Twitter. My name is DanBot. Later.